There's nothing like the prayer of parents. There's nothing like the prayer of, uh, of a father. I tell you, if I ever get in trouble, I want Lucian praying for me because he understands you need to stand. You need to be immovable. Here's some great news for you. Your heavenly father is listening to the prayers of Jesus Christ himself. He ever lives to give intercession for the saints. So that's you. He stands immovable. When we're faithless, he remains faithful. He cannot deny himself. Keep that in mind when you pray. You're actually joining in with the prayers of Jesus. And he is instructing us to pray that God's will would be done on earth as it is in heaven. So in heaven, is there anybody sick? Anybody with diabetes? Anybody in a coma? Well, the answer to that is clearly no. That's not allowed in heaven. And so that's God's will. Let's pray for his will to be done on earth in your body as it is in heaven. Now, before we pray, we've got some other encouraging words for you. Here's Joy who emailed us. On February 23rd, Ashley gave a word of knowledge for me. She said, heart palpitations would leave. Well, God healed me immediately. God sees and he knows. Ashley, thank you for your obedience. Wow. Well, that's amazing. This is, uh, this is from Orlean. She says, for more than 10 years, Orlean of Grandview, Missouri, suffered with pain from deteriorating knees. Her doctor confirmed the cartilage had worn away and the meniscus was torn. Orlean just happened to tune into the 700 Club when she heard Gordon say, you are laying hands, <clears throat> excuse me, hands on both knees. There is tremendous pain. All of the pain is dissipating. All of the cartilage is being restored, and there will be full function from this moment forward. While Gordon spoke, Orlean felt a warm sensation permeate her knees. As she got up and walked to her bedroom, her right knee didn't buckle and her knees didn't hurt. Orlean called the CBN prayer line rejoicing. Amen. Hallelujah. Can you explain these miracles? The answer is no, you can't. Because if you could explain it, it wouldn't be a miracle. God operates in the supernatural. He operates in a realm that is invisible to us. But when he does, when he moves, miracles break out. He wants miracle power to be released in you. Don't, don't look to your symptom. Don't look to the problem. Look to the answer. He's right there. The kingdom of heaven is in your midst. It's within you. Let that kingdom have dominion over your problem. We'll pray. We'll believe. And let God do the rest. Pray with us. Lord Jesus Christ, we come to you. We declare that you are the Savior, that you are the healer, that you are the restorer. You are the one who has redeemed us. We are your special treasure, the reason that you, you came, the reason you gave your life. So, Lord, we see that. We see your promise. We see the joy that was set before you. We see these things. And now we ask that we would be healed, that we would be set free from all pain, all infirmity. For anyone lying in a hospital bed, stretch forth your hand to do miracles. Manifest your presence in that hospital room. Let there be peace, let there be healing, and let there be joy in the morning for what you have done. We receive all of your blessings now. We receive everything that you have for us. Enable us to apprehend. Enable us to hear it, to see it. Give us a heart of understanding that we may know the greatness of your power. Ashley Gunn's given you some. Yeah, I believe someone's watching. You have some type of fungus on your left foot and it's actually gotten also into your nail beds and you're just it's it's painful you have asked God for healing the Lord is healing that for you right now that fungus will begin to disappear even right now just believe 
that the Lord is healing you because he is. Stand firm in faith. You are healed by the stripes of Jesus Christ. Uh, there's someone you have an ulcerated bowel and you're actually on a surgery waiting list. God is healing you right now. He's able to restore all of the cell walls, all of the intestinal walls. He's able to take ulcers away. He's able to cleanse out all infection, all of that leaving you now. You just felt a surge go throughout your entire body. God is healing you. He's setting you free from that. Someone with recurring sinus infections, I believe it's uh, related to mold, and it, it's uh, of a particular problem today. And it's like your sinuses are inflamed and swollen, causing pain. God is healing that. And he's able to increase your resistance to that mold. He's able to cleanse all of that out um, and cleanse even your house so you don't have a recurrence in Jesus' name be restored and be made whole. I also believe someone's watching uh, a, a, a woman, you're having problems like pain in your belly button. Uh, I'm not sure what that's from, but you're, you're experiencing some pain. You're actually not sure what it's from either and you're concerned about it. The Lord is healing that for you from this moment forward. You will not have to struggle with that. Just claim this healing, declare it, and let it be so that you are healed from the top of your head to the soles of your feet in Jesus' name. Uh, there's someone you've been diagnosed with bladder cancer, and, and it's, this is a recurrence. You've already been through the treatment one time, and this is now a recurrence. God's able to cleanse you and make you whole, make you completely cancer-free. In Jesus' name, be healed. Be set free from this disease. Be set free from all fear, all anxiety. Let perfect peace guard your heart and mind now, in Jesus' name. Lord, we thank you. We thank you for all that you have done, all that you are doing, for you are the same yesterday, today, and forever. When we receive you, we receive the answer to all our need. Thank you. We receive it all in your name. Amen. If you need prayer, we're here for you. All you have to do is pick up the phone and call us. Just like Lucian, we believe in prevailing prayer. We believe in standing with people in prayer. It's our honor, our privilege to pray for you. And if you'd like to share a miracle that's happened to you, just give us a call too, 1-800-700-7000.